Supercross race teams are structured in a way that lays out a well-defined hierarchy in relation to the roles and responsibilities of running the organization. Team owners work across the entirety of the team, from rider appointment, sponsorship arrangements, research and development, and the hiring of appropriate staff, to name a few tasks. The team owner serves as the backbone, steering the team in the general direction of success. Atop the technical department sit the lead technicians, who are usually divided into engine, suspension, and chassis specialists. It's important that this group work cohesively, understanding the overall complexity of the motorcycle, to allow each respective component to work in unison with the other. Horsepower is great, although not so much when the wheels aren't on the ground due to suspension difficulties. The mechanics are the rider's right-hand man, taking care of the motorcycle to ensure it's ready to race. From engine rebuilds, suspension tweaks, pit boarding, amongst other things, mechanics make sure that the riders are comfortable based off of the data from the techs and the feedback of the athlete in pursuit of creating the perfect motorcycle for their riders' specific needs. It's important for a Supercross race team to work together in unison for the desired result, as success is dependent on the culmination of each member's role and responsibility. Winning is a team effort, from boardroom meetings right until the final gate drop. <laughs>